Hey you guys from the forest and the lake. I just had a bath, which is why my hair looks not super <laughs> video proper. <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's pretty windy, so I hope the sound will be okay. I hope you can hear more of the birds and the water and me, obviously, than the wind. Or else I will have to make another video because there's a energy now, which is huge collectively which is victim consciousness. So I want to talk a little bit about victim state, about presence and about free choice. Because it is when we are playing out the same pattern of a victim state, which most of us are in some area of our lives very easily, or we are holding ourselves back because of a fear or we have a limiting belief around who we are or what we can do um, and we keep being in that or we keep playing out that like if we are in a victim state it's so easy to just start projecting out on others what is conflict uh, inside of us or what we are unsure of our own insecurities, our own fears um, and if there is a fear or a limiting belief it's so easy to hold ourselves back not not really going for maybe what we want to do um, trying to control something because we don't know exactly how something is going to turn out or we're afraid of failing um, of making the wrong decision you know, there's so many, so many possibilities <laughs> where in our lives we can play out these patterns. But if we are deeply present, really, really present, and we have awareness of where we have those limiting beliefs, where we come into a victim state when we are triggered into it then we can start changing it and it is with that this is so important because when we have that awareness when we are present and we are not bypassing that we are not just playing out the same pattern again uh, trying to run away from it or distracting ourselves from it or you know any coping mechanism that we have learned that was very helpful for us at some point in our lives and then it's not really anymore because it's turning into a coping mechanism that keeps us from having a deeper awareness having the expansion um, and the gift and the possibility and any trigger that comes up to free ourselves even more and to hold that frequency for the rest of the planet so that we have the ripple effect of the new frequency that we embody and the processes now can go much faster than it did because we hold more of that light and that high frequency in our bodies so if we are in a behavior or we find ourselves being triggered in into a victim state or we are projecting out on someone or we find ourselves in that same pattern it's the same thought coming up again um, why me poor me um, I'm doing this, or I'm not being seen, or I'm, um, I'm again, I'm again in this, uh, having this feeling because of this or that which happened, or um, I'm always feeling like this. I'm uh, never able to do this thing, or you know, all those things that we can feel again and again and again and we know our own patterns because when we are in a feeling like that it we get the thought immediately oh, oh i'm here again and i mean that's quite well known for most of us in some area of our life or several areas of our lives when we are in that and we have that awareness that is when we can change so when we are in the challenging circumstances, that is when we can make the most transformation. So how present can you be when you are challenged? How deeply present can you be with yourself 
so that you can choose another behavior. You can choose another thought or you can choose to go into another emotion. I'm not talking now about bypassing anything because it's really important. When you, when we don't have any fears of feeling our emotions and we feel them through, they are not a threat for us either. So it's not about bypassing anything or trying to shift out of in the sense of getting away from. But by not being afraid of the emotion or the thought or the pattern while we're in it and we have the awareness and we're deeply present with it, it can move through really quickly. And that is where we have the choice. That is your choice and yours alone. No matter who triggers you, no matter what the circumstances around you are, how ma- no matter how difficult or challenging or amazing or you know how lucky or unlucky you are, that is where your power is. That power is yours. No one can take that power away from you. No one. Never. You have the choice when you are present with the awareness you have to make a different choice. You don't need anyone outside of you to make those choices. If you want to have a relationship Are you the one you would be in a relationship with? If not, start becoming that person. If you are constantly coming back to a victim state, if you are constantly coming back to some thought pattern, some feeling, what can you change? Because you have You have the opportunity, you have the possibility. It can be the smallest things, but do them and do it for you. Because when you change and when you shift, there will be ripples as well. And the more of you you can be and the more you choose to be deeply present, not present only to the the point of seeing Uh, that you are in fear or feeling whatever is coming up but so present that you can feel that this is a fear and this is not really the truth this is an emotion it's not who I am this is a thought or it's a pattern it's a behavior it's a coping mechanism and it's not who I am when you know deeply and you're so present that you know that this is not who I am it can pass through you And you can make a different choice. You are always in the power of making a new choice to choose another behavior, to choose a different reaction. It's... Let me just see, because they're starting to show me something. Mm. Yeah, because they say it's it's almost like the deepest fear some people have is to be truly present because we are afraid of feeling our emotions or we are afraid of the judgment we have of ourselves when we become aware Oh, where we are holding ourselves back or where we are maybe not behaving in the best way or you know it's not about judging anything take judgment completely out of the picture it's just about awareness it's just about making a different choice than you have made before I hope this is helpful for you guys I hope you got to enjoy some of the nature the sun is coming out finally if this resonated feel free to share it it's very helpful to get the videos to circulate when you comment and like share subscribe i'm very grateful for all of you guys being here 
Um, hope this is helpful. I will see you in the next video. Take good care of yourselves and have compassion for others and be super present and make those new choices because we're shifting quickly right now. Bye bye.